Hi, everyone. My name is Felicia Stiano. I'm 16 years old, and I'm from Indonesia. I'm a student, a diver, and a person who simply loves the ocean. Hi, I'm George Klaus. I'm 12. I'm from England. I'm a student, a diver, and I love sharks. <laughs> Hello, I'm Rebecca Penty. I'm 18 years old, and I'm from Finland. I'm a student, a diver, and a potential future marine biologist. Hi, everyone. I'm Simran Sampat. I'm 14 years old, a student, a diver, and a future psychiatrist. We today present ourselves as members of the Tawasul Steering Committee. Tawasul simply means to reach out in Arabic, and that has become our vision. We want to connect to people, and we want to connect to nature. By all means, we are still normal teenagers. We still go to school, we still have to do our homework, and we still go out with our friends. But we all chose to be involved in Tawasul because we all have a passion towards the ocean. We know how beautiful the ocean really is, and we don't want that beauty to diminish in the future. And that's the reason that we don't mind waking up at 5 or 6 a.m. in the weekends to go to the fish market or to go to Oman and learn on how to conserve the ocean. Because we think it's for the greater cause. And maybe for some of you guys, when you were younger, you didn't have to worry about this issue too much. Because the situation wasn't so devastating then. But the destruction will not stop until nothing is left if nothing is done. It is really said that at least 70% of the world consists of the ocean, but only very, very few people actually care about them. A famous quote by Arthur C. Clarke is, how inappropriate to call this planet Earth when it is quite clearly ocean. Out of the many opportunities we have to protect the ocean at Tawasul, one of my favorites is the beach cleanup. You wouldn't believe the amount of rubbish we find at the beaches. I've also got another great story to tell you about a turtle. We called him Joe in the end. These water skiers found Joe in the water with the missing flipper, so he went out to rescue him. We dived straight in and pulled him out. He was quite heavy. On the way back, I, it was quite rough. I could feel him breathing. I somehow felt connected to him. Can you believe that just two years ago I started diving for fun? Diving opened up a whole new world for me. A world where you can feel weightless while still having a heavy tank on your back. But diving is addictive as sugar. Once you start, you really just can't stop. I wanted to help save the wonderful place that we belong for food, diving, and having fun. Tawasal is always trying to help educate and conserve the vast and very different place known to us as the ocean. It is said we know more about the surface of the moon than we do about the ocean. Let's change that today. I coordinate the research volunteers for Tawasul, and while doing this, I got in contact with Rima Chabadov, a marine scientist and project leader of the Gulf Elastomer Project, which focuses on rays and sharks here in the UAE. Did you know that 90% of the world's sharks have been wiped out, and that close to 100 million sharks are killed every year for their fins? However, not that much information about sharks here in the UAE. So what I do with Rima is important because people can't make informed choices without scientific information and knowledge. So basically what we do is go to the fish landing sites and markets, identify the species, get measurements, and take DNA samples. One day, we sampled more than 200 sharks at only two fish markets. For me, seeing the amount of sharks and other rare or endangered fish caught daily in the UAE is rather shocking. I have, however, also met the fishermen who depend on fish as their main source of income. It is not possible for the fishermen to completely stop fishing, and that is not what we in Tawasul want. In fact, what we want is to make fishing more sustainable. In the end, it is all about making the right choices. We also... We also support the Choose Wisely campaign. As already mentioned by Rebecca, sharks are heavily overfished, but they aren't the only species. There are others like the Hamor, the Hamor, the Golden Travai, and the Kingfish, which are also heavily overfished. Um, this campaign simply encourages people to buy fish that are sustainably fished. We actually got the chance to talk about it on a local TV show. We also took an approach to write letters to managers of restaurants asking them to take out unsustainable fish such as bluefin tuna off their menu 
or at least give the customers a choice. The concept of choose wisely is not just what you eat, but also other choices you make in life. We are still young people, and we like to hang out with friends and have fun with them, but we understand the importance of connecting with nature, and we understand that the way we live our lives today will have an impact on the future of tomorrow. And we know, we know that by doing this, we are making changes. We are making an impact amongst our friends, amongst our families, and amongst the greater community that we live in. And that's what matters to us. It is said that you're either an activist or an inactivist. All of us will probably contribute to this matter in different ways in the future, but right now, we, as the Tabasol Steering Committee, have only one common dream. And that is to ignite the fire that brings about change. Thank you.